Hello, this is a, another ice belt questionnaire and uh, this one once again made by Husker and it's apparently it's a lot longer and bigger than the last one uh, and we're gonna do it so uh, I'll answer these questions maybe elaborate on some of them too yeah so I've already filled in a lot of these questions these are from the original questionnaire the the first version which I already have on YouTube uh, with comments and everything on these ones so if you want to watch and see all these ones then uh, go ahead and click over there uh, but we're gonna skip past it for this one uh, have you ever got upset slash emotional at iceberg racing oh i think only once and uh i never it's it was never recorded or anything but uh one of the off season two qualifying races i was really upset that um, during qualifying of that race, I really lagged out and I wasn't given the opportunity to, uh, qualify despite like me missing completely, uh, the qualifying and starting in the back, they didn't allow me to offer another spot. And I was really upset because uh, obviously I wanted to be in off season and I was in a peculiar spot where it was close to me not making it in. So it, it mattered a lot and I kind of got, yeah, kind of got into my head a little bit, but yeah, unfortunately, yes, I have. If you had a Schliemann tag placed on a belt, uh, track you built, yep, I built BCC and then laser slapped that on. Um, I don't know why he did so, but he did. Do you frequently play other racing games? <sighs> I don't know, frequently, not right now. Um, I used to. Uh, some of the, you know, Horizon, Forza Horizon and those games I played a bit. I'm gonna say yes, despite me not doing them recently. It hasn't, yeah, it's been a while, but yeah. Uh, got a family member to try ice boat racing. Uh, yes, and my brother has once. Got a friend IRL or online to try ice boat racing. Uh, yes. Um, yes, I have. Um, this was a while ago, but yes, I have. Have you ever met an ice boat racer in person? Yes, I've met Laser. Have you attended an Ice Boat Racing Awards Gala? Yes, I have. I've attended both of them. Um, as of now, I've attended both of them. Um, and I won the you know, awards I won. Um, I think Greatest Me maybe was one of them. And um, Biggest Event, or Best Event, I think I won for BCC. Uh, oh, yeah, here's the question, actually. I should have read fast. Yes, I won an award. Yes, it's those two, I believe. Uh, have you ever had one of your tracks used in off-season? Yes, I have. I've had two of my tracks, both BCC and Racers Rainforest, have made into off-season two. Racers Rainforest as a qualifying track and BCC as a racetrack, race day three, I believe. Have you ever played in the Kira minigame? Yes, I have. Uh, you built one a little a while ago. It was some shooter game where you, like, I don't know, you had like classes and heroes and stuff. I don't, I don't remember, it was a while ago. Have you ever completed a Kira's Escape Room? Uh, <laughs> uh, Adam and I did a video on that and uh, we only got as far as third before we broke the map. So uh, we should probably finish that at some point. Uh, but uh, no, not at not this moment, I haven't. Have you ever represented ABG at the Cubed event? Yes, I was on the panel for that. Uh, we talked about how ice boat racing works and you know kind of giving people at that that event knowledge on what we are and what we do and everything like that so definitely have you ever spent more than 10 hours driving slash time traveling a track Ooh, I gotta think about this one I'm gonna say yes I'm gonna say yes and I it's the two completely separate sections that combine together that probably get me there um it would be Midgar Circuit. Yes, Midgar Circuit. Um, it was both a qualifying track in off season one and off season two. And uh, I've put a lot of hours into that both times. So I'm going to say combined of those two times. Yes, I've, I've probably driven a lot of time on that track, but not pretty close, though. I know there's some people who've Google like easy check this, but that was a hard one. Um, so Ever skip sla uh, class slash work to ice boat race? Nope. 
Uh, have you watched the Makuza music video? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, this is a music video that, for whatever reason, Makuzin has of some song, and I don't really know the full story behind it, but he has it, and it's funny. Uh, I mean, people point it a lot. Uh, have you ever podium in an official race? Yep. Uh, I've done it in Eldham, and I've done it in a few beer and WC, a few beer and WC races as well, I've done it. Ever race from the, uh, from the back of the pack? Uh, last the first challenge. No, I don't. I don't think so. Well, I guess I've only won the one race. No, that was not from the back. That was from the front. So no, I have not. I've tried this. I've tried legitimately tried this on some tracks, but it's it's really hard. And then the tracks that I didn't try was was impossible. So there's no way. Do you usually hold a swivel while driving a boat? No. I don't know why people do this. Uh, it's so they protect themselves from breaking the track and like left clicking and breaking blocks, but. Why are you left clicking? I don't understand. I don't know the point of it. It's, I don't know, I don't understand. Uh, have you ever had a meme slash running joke made about you? Of course, uh, I'm pretty well known for this. I'm sure everyone's pointing to me about this. Like, yes, this is definitely something that, that Blue has done. Yeah, uh, lagging out in CTP a long time ago has, has stuck around for almost a year. And uh, yeah, no, this, this thing is for sure. Um, yeah. Have you ever made a tier list about boat racing list slash ice boat tracks? Yes, I even have a video on this a while ago. It was on uh, dry, uh, drivers, and that was a while ago, so the things have changed now. This, that was before off season two, I believe. Uh, so yeah, I should do one when off season two finishes, but you know, there's there's spoilers and stuff involved, so I, you know, I don't know. So yeah, I have. Have you ever been quote and quote me on that? I'm sure I have. I don't need any check. Uh, fallen asleep in a VC? <laughs> no, no, I haven't. I, I think only one person is allowed to check this off. If I see any other people check this off, I'm questioning them because this does not happen normally. Have you ever earned any money from ice boat racing? Unfortunately not. Uh, I know there's some people who have. I think Crafty's won some money from a Dutch uh, competition. Uh, but yeah. Uh, have you scald in VC? I, you know, this, uh, if you don't know, this is, uh, whenever it says scald, which is like a Swedish word, it means to drink. And so, like, the point is, you drop everything you're doing and you drink. Uh, but I don't drink alcohol, but I do drink water when I, when, when somebody says so, just to acknowledge it. So I drink water, but no, not, not the alcohol. Um, as per the question, I guess, uh, you know, Husker, whoever's reviewing this can, can put me on yes or no. I'm gonna put yes because I drink water, but if I'm more Swedish, I would know what that involves, but yeah. Have you ever voice acted in a boat racing video? Uh, I mean, I do, I, I do, uh, like, you know, these, these talks or these things, but I don't think I voice act. You know what? No, you know what? You know, no, 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 no. I've done it once. I've done it once. Okay, okay. The, the Frost X. The Frost X server guide, okay, you, you, it's like very short, a very short spot. You spawn in and then there's me and I say, hey, I'm blue, I want to be your guide, okay? That, that is my voice acting, okay? That was not recorded while I was standing there. That was after the fact and uh, I was reading a script. Yes, I have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> have you ever been a member of a league winning team? Yes, I have been a part of... Uh, Evergreen, who won just won BRWC League B. Uh, have you ever completed more pit stops than that was required in a race? Ooh, I don't normally want to. Maybe I have done it once. I might have, but I can't recall it happening. So I'm going to say no, but I don't know. I, if, I might remember it and come back to it. I don't know. Who knows? But I don't think I have. Have ever played a non Minecraft game with some of the community? Yep. Uh, a while back, we had a video about uh, uh, Forza Horizon, and uh, we did like ice hockey in there with a bunch of random people online. Uh, it's on Adam's channel that we did that on, and uh, that was a while ago. But yeah, we did it with I did it with Adam and Crispy, I think. Maybe yeah, who else joined on that? But Sam, I think, was there and Toki maybe for some bit. But yeah, I've done that. I've ever used first person entire race? Uh, not an official race. Not not a 
officially sanctioned Reese or anything. Uh, I've I've done it in like practice or whatever, but not or fun races, but not not an actual race. No. Uh, I've ever used a steering wheel controller non keyboard method for boat racing. Uh, I've tried using controller before just to see what happens. Uh, tip: it doesn't really work, but I have done it before, and I only not not an actual race, but I have done it. Uh, I'm gonna say yes because yeah, I think I think that's good. Uh, have you ever streamed? No, but I've recorded it, obviously. Yeah, but I've never streamed that. Maybe eventually I will, but here and there there's distractions or something stupid I say and I like cutting it out, honestly. So maybe in the future that this will change, but for now it's different like that. Have you ever achieved a boat tap overtake? Uh, yep, I have. And gosh, there's a Bloedel race I did one on. I don't even know what we were racing in. Is that Pig League? I think so. But I know I've done one there, and I've done it a few times before, uh, unrecorded, but yeah, no, I've done boat tap overtakes. Those are impressive, by the way. If you ever get the chance to do one, I appreciate it. Boat tap overtakes are like collecting hole-in-ones in golf. Have you had to be someone from the community's therapist? Ooh, this is a touchy subject, I think. Hmm. I mean, I've given advice to people on how to deal with things, but fixing someone's, I don't know, I don't, I, they're, I don't know the whole therapy thing, but, you know, I, like, uh, I've given advice on social arguments. I've done that. Uh, I'm gonna put yes. If, if, uh, Husker or anyone who wants to change this, please go ahead. I, I don't know. Have you ever completed a one block wide track? Yeah, I've done tons of these recently. <laughs> they definitely, uh, definitely, uh, get the views. Uh, have you ever listened to Eurobeat? Or listened to Eurobeat? Of course, everyone has listened to Eurobeat. I don't normally listen to it, but I have heard it before, right? I use it in my videos, but uh, I don't really enjoy it that much either. It's a little bit too much, but I have heard it. So yeah, yeah, of course, I've listened to it. Uh, have you built an ice boat track in survival? No, no, I can pick up. I probably have them super young, maybe. I don't, I don't know what. Have you, do you ever use in-game voice chat? Yep. Uh, first time I used that was the Australian Grand Prix last year. It's really, that was a really fun race just because of that fact. It was pretty enjoyable though. I've been a victim of an ill-timed elevator switch on Coconut Mall. Uh, yes, I have. And I especially have been a victim of people turning around as I'm going in and it gets really messy. And that was, yeah, that wasn't fun. Uh, or people getting stuck at the top of those elevators. If you look, if you watch the off-season uh, Coconut Mall video, you'll see plenty of this. It's pretty obvious. How'd your world record get Makuzin'd? You know, the world records I I set don't normally get. You know what? Yes, yes, I have had a world record get Makuzin'd. It was on my own track. It was it was at Desert Sands. Uh, I put in. It was it was my first track I ever built. And so I wanted to get like a respectful time compared to what I did long ago. And so I put a few hours into it and, and uh, yeah, no, got Makuzin. <laughs> if you don't know what Makuzin means, it means that you spend a lot of time getting into a, you know, getting a good time on a track. And then uh, Makuzin comes in and breaks it in like 15 minutes is usually the, the most notable example is that he did it on Mount Kina, I believe. Have you ever been in a race restart? Yep, Coconut Mall has done it. Have you ever intentionally let someone pass during a race? Yeah, uh, in CGP I did it for my off-season buddies. I've done it in, well, I did it a few times in off-season when I lag out, so um, yeah, I have. Had someone team advise you during the race? Yep, uh, off-season one we had a few. Occasionally Team Storm would have one, not as much as any of the other teams, but we would have one in Coconut Mall. I think that was it. I think. Actually, we had two. Julian and Chris, we were team advising for us, and that was our only ever time we had been team advised. Um, of course, I do it for a League B I occasionally do, or a Beer WC League B I occasionally do, but generally, I bet compared to most people, I don't get team advised that often, so I think maybe I have a little bit of an extra skill not being needed to be team advised. Do I know what beep beep bop is? No? This, I don't know what this is. Uh, have you ever applied to keep someone from winning slash doing well in a race? 
yes. Uh, <laughs> Soda Soaker screen right now, because yes, we tried doing that. Uh, the last race in Beer WC in League A. Uh, a bunch of people were out that time, and so I was able to fill in, and it was a battle between for the, first, the, the win of the entire league. Um, it was between Techno Gustav, my teammate, and Soda. And it just happened to be so. It just happened to be that uh, Julian needed a driver in his team, and so I was able to. And I just did it just because, but I didn't realize that this was also going on. And also, my teammate in League B, uh, Altero, was in was was in that race too. And Laser was, of course, the you know the normal teammate in League A. So there's four of us all trying to, you know. Well, there's three of us trying to slow down Soda, and Gustav was trying to just take off. So yes, this is that happened. It was pretty funny. Uh, have you used duck support? No, I don't need it. Uh, no, I have not. Did I join the Icebelt community before knowing what F1 was? Of course, this seems like a redundant question because everybody has heard of F1. I didn't watch it before joining. Now I do. This season I started watching it, but... Uh, before I didn't watch it, I heard about it. Of course, everybody everybody knows what F one is, right? Like, everyone knows that at least to the point of it's a racing league. Uh, but no, and everybody else should too, unless unless they live under a rock, maybe. Uh, ever been fooled by an FC one track gimmick? Uh, yeah, I've been fooled by the first one. I know that. Uh, the first one was at Paul Ricard. Uh, it was a cheese grater, and this was 2021, maybe? Uh, and uh, it was a cheese grater that had a bunch of holes in one of the turns, and if you fall through it, it lost you like 20 seconds. It was awful. Um, I I know in the like the track, the, I know in the video highlights of that, of that race, it shows me going across it fine, but later in the race, I do fall in it. I know that. Uh, of course, I've done it a few other times as well. Uh, power card the next year. Uh, so 2022, the bloopers got me once. It's pretty bad. Uh, but pretty fun too. And in the cheese, in the the pong walls also got me too in that race. So yeah, definitely. I uh, know all, all the lyrics to uh, Weefy song. He, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's from off season at Boat Park. That was race day two, actually. And uh, yeah, Paul. Uh, Paul lagged so hard that he got all these clips together of him saying really weird things. Um, this is before he knew much English, so he was a little he was struggling a little on the English front, and he was a little frustrated too. So all these weird words came out, and uh, yeah, it was made into a song. So yeah, I think Hidden Corner built that song. So yeah, props to him for making that hilarious. Ever built a track in a real location and not in F1 tracks? Hmm. No. Um, the only one I can think of that's like this is something like Blodell is based off of a real park. But I don't... Yeah, no, none of my tracks are based off of real things, though. Um, technically, BCC, canonically. If you want to get into, like, lore or whatever, BCC is, like, Seattle and most. They just space needle in there, and it's kind of... The buildings are based off of Seattle buildings, but it's not actually Seattle. But, uh, but no, that, that probably wouldn't count, though. Do I use a racing themed Minecraft skin? Yes, actually, it is. Uh, the skin I use is a racing skin. Uh, I built it for racing, and despite it not looking like a helmet or anything, it just looked nice as a little uniform thing, and I've kept it this whole time. So, yes, and now just to point, it's to the point where I use it so often that I don't switch off of it. It's 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 always on. Have you driven on or I, I actually don't know what this is. O R E. This is. Or something that I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Okay. <laughs> uh, I've crossed the finish line backwards in a boat. I've spun on the line. I that probably at some point a few times I've spun on the line. I've finished backwards, but I, I haven't like gone backwards, you know, and hold the S to get across. Um, I have a short that uh, I have a funny short of Lapis doing that and losing a, a fun race against Crispy. Uh, that was pretty enjoyable. I've spun, but I don't think you know this. This is like one of those like gray areas. I've 
Yes, probably if you freeze frame. If you freeze frame right and right when I cross the finish line, I'll be facing backwards. So technically, yes. But yeah, I would want to say that. Have you visited Laser's Playground? I know what it is. Yeah, it's his little area of... Uh, he just has a bunch of pastes. I visited a long time ago, I think. I, I, maybe, maybe not the same one as, as Laser's Playground, but I've seen one of his. That's just a bunch of random pastes everywhere. Uh, and to like copy, but yeah, I've visited one of them. I think, you know, something of like, of his, but yeah. Have you ever done donuts in the ice boat race? I think... I think this is just spinning. I like just spinning across the line, so I'm gonna say yeah. I was just talking about it. I've spun across the line before, so I guess that's as close as you can get. You can't really do like spin donuts. You can't... Yeah, you can't really do that. Have you missed a race because your parents made you do something IRL? Uh, not really my parents, but I had to go on a flight in one, one race. I did. Yeah, I had to get on a flight during uh, Red Bull Ring last year. I had to, I had to leave. I got like three laps in. I was holding strong in a fourth place, you know, coming out of the start, and uh, yeah, I had to leave. <laughs> so unfortunately, that was that race. I was really looking forward to, but yeah, I guess it gives me a point on this question. Have I driven on a Rainbow Road in Minecraft? Yep, for sure. I've driven just about every single one on Frost Hex, So yeah. Have you ever led in a race? Oh yeah, I've done it a few times. Uh, I'm, I think a lot of people notice me as someone who likes to pit late, um, and a lot of that, a lot of times, means I will be leading the race for some reason. So, have you seen rocket slides? Oh gosh, this is a stupid question. Uh, I, yeah, I, I don't know why this is a thing, but. Yeah, there's an image going around of him with- yeah, I- I- this is stupid. Yes, I've seen it. It's a ridiculous thing. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. You race in these leagues, and a lot of these- some of these might surprise you, so, uh, let's get into it. MRA? Yep, I've done an MRA. I did it once, I think. Or twice. Uh, it's- it was an abysmal league, I'll tell you that. It was a bunch of stupid guys, and, uh, the only people who beat me were any- any other ABG guys, so, yeah. Uh, MREC, I, I'm surprised they even did races. I Nobody, I think, I don't, I've never heard people talk about this league other than myself on that league comparison video. Uh, MBC, uh, no, but I, I watch, yeah, I pay attention to that sometimes. IBWRC, uh, no, I haven't. Formula Ice, yep. Uh, Formula Cell Sidecraft, I don't think ever... Oh wait, yes, I did. I did it in a test race. The test race I was in this, but I don't remember. I think they only did maybe one, one actual race. Or maybe they didn't even do that. I know they did a test race, and I don't remember them, them doing it past that. I know they never finished the season, I'm sure. From L time, yep, I did that for two seasons, actually. Those are pretty short seasons, but yeah. Uh, FC1, of course. Uh, I, of course, I'm the commentator for FC2, so I will never race in FC2 myself. Uh, but since I'm a commentator, I'm gonna say yes. TT Friday? Yeah, I've done TT Friday. Uh, I don't know how popular those are anymore. I can't really get to those anymore, but um, I don't know how they are doing now. A beer WC? Yup. Off season? Yep. Point going championship? Yep. Stinky Cup? Yep. And Blind Tech? Yeah. So. Maybe we gotta, we gotta get a, well this doesn't exist anymore, I don't think, well it's called BEC now, or is, or I don't remember, this, this, they changed their name so many times, it's, it's an MRA based endurance league, and they changed their name a lot of times, like three times or something, so it, yeah, um, maybe I should, these are hosted like early in the morning for me, so that's why I don't do. I be to see. I don't know. I just never felt interested in it. I might be pretty good at it, but I just I don't know. There you go. That's my submission, and uh, let's do a score again. I got a hundred and a hundred thirty-five. Um, I believe there is an image somewhere. Let's pull that up. Yeah. So there's two images uh, right here. So there's this one. This is the bottom half of this league. This was updated yesterday, so my time won't be in here yet. But yeah, I got 100 points, so that will put me right in line with Renokas. Hey, Reno. 
Uh, there you go. Uh, <laughs> I wonder what <laughs> what extra ones these other guys have, have been on. I'm surprised some of these have actually, yeah, like Fantasy and Rocket, I'm surprised they're up here. Priority too. I don't know what they... Jolly? Wait, Jolly hasn't driven like that many races at all. I don't know, I'm surprised. Uh, well, there you go. That that was the uh, the ice boat racing questionnaire. And, uh, you know, if you have any extra questions that you want to ask me in the comments, you can ask them or answer. Maybe there'll be a third one. I <laughs> Oscar was talking about it last time that after she published the first one, it was instantly like, there's so many of these other questions that I forgot to ask. And so maybe maybe this I want I don't know how you guys are doing this. Uh, There'll be a link in my description of this if you want to try and answer and not not answer. Remember, this isn't like a how well can you actually, you know, how high of a score you can get. Let's try and cheat our way out of all these. No, no, don't do that. Just answer honestly and um, have a good time because the cheating on a course like this is stupid. <laughs> anyway, happy racing.